and it is going to be secure area on the new discovery quick match so this is gonna be interesting and we start off with attackers so we are gonna be on the cliff side we're gonna pick Thatcher everything is all right here uh, we're gonna be picking the breach judge there we go now I must say that my initial reaction to the Thatcher nerf meaning that he just disables all his gadgets rather than destroys them was severely negative severely negative and here's the thing I don't see that changing because to me the nerf is not necessarily aimed at what most is most likely the majority level of play because I don't think that the majority of Siege players do have the same four people that they play Siege with. But there is far too many people that basically does it like me and plays on... Play, plays a solo queue with random people, basically. And there are also people playing casual and stuff like that. And that's the point. The... They claim that casual and high level ranked and the uh, pro leagues is the aim of the ban, but they don't really seem to consider that low rank is most likely the largest, uh, low rank and casual are the largest player base. And the reason I don't like this nerf is because coordination is what is usually lacking at these levels. Co the coordination that makes a hard breacher go when Thatcher says it is clear. That is, coordina that is coordination that is necessary. And it just became even more necessary. Now, I understand that they have added different, different stuff that is supposed to make stuff easier. And they have added new gadgets that can breach and stuff like that. But still, the problem lies in that enemy detected outside. Dock on top. Secure the room. Protect the bio container. Whoops! <laughs> Wamai is gonna get a rude surprise there. We're gonna take it. Well, we got cocked in the crossfire, but still, that was not too bad. We did manage to get an injury on his mate, so hopefully our team can... ...make something happen with that. That was really... A nice grenade throw. Oh, that was that was really really tight. One friendly operator remaining. Well, Maverick is gonna have his job cut out for him. Nice. Nice try. So basically, what happened was with me dying there was that I was convinced there was more people on the objective than, or rather inside than, yeah. So we're gonna be picking our boy again. So basically, that kind of coordination with the hard breachers is going to be lost. So that is and the second of the new one. And that kind of coordination is necessary for the attackers to be a viable force. And add to that that they added the reinforcement pool, meaning that a single decent player can reinforce in an objective much easier. I mean, if someone else didn't reinforce, then tough luck, they didn't reinforce. But now everything is going to be used. 
And I think that's part of why they added the hard breaching gadget. But the hard breaching gadget doesn't really solve the problem. Not entirely. Because if you got one mute and one bandit, and to be honest, I had that composition multiple times, then you can seal off a lot of entrances to a room and suddenly all you have is a free is a 15 minute window. A 15 minute window that I might add, gets smaller if they just pick up the gadget. And that's the part that bothers me the most, because I understand what they're trying to do, that removing the gadget is going to going to take time. But if they're gonna be have if they're gonna have a disable timer, then make and, uh, it seconds. mandatory to pick it up. To be honest. Make the gadget disabled, but make it mandatory to pick it up and redeploy it. If they made that, I would not have a problem with this change. I would literally not have a problem with the change, because it would be... It would force whoever is guarding the area to actually be in the area. It would reinforce their role as an anchor. On the window. And if the if the role as an anchor was reinforced, then suddenly there's not really that much of a problem with it anymore, to be honest. Which mirror side and visual. I can hear someone. Well, I needed to go once up one stairs, it seems, but I can't do that over here now. It seems like the stairs have moved. Warden and bar. Go downstairs in all of it in main lobby. Sorry, I'm to help you. Friendly last operator standing on the right. Well, it was a nice try. I'm a little bit too tired, I've been fighting against Microsoft Flight Simulator Downloader for the majority of the evening, but still. I just wish there would be an actual opportunity for me to actually display what I'm talking about regarding Thatcher here. But so far, that hasn't happened. So, right now, I basically am committed to just... Let's go mute and see if we have any opportunity to counter any fetcher place and see if that becomes easier or... But yeah, take mute, take bandit, take Cade for example. If you were to make a disabled gadget that you have to pick it up, I mean you really have to pick it up, then I would be okay with the change. And that goes for any gadget, I mean Valk cam, whatever. As long as it's picked up and redeployed, it works again. Fair enough. Because then the gadgets need to be watched over. Then they need to... Then not clearing them out after they're disabled is a whole matter entirely. But it doesn't work that way. Basically, if you, if you just leave it going, then you just leave it going. So, uh, I'm not, I still don't like what they've done with Thatcher, and part of it is because I have been relying on being able to not have 
decent communication. Because it hasn't hasn't been necessary. And well it still has been necessary, but I can base take um canal for example. There is a path where you, you can just throw a grenade. You can just eat it. And what will happen is that that grenade is going to take out the most possible spot for jammers or anything like that. That's that's nice. That is something that you can do, and I, I'll grant it. It's it's powerful. If you know how to play Thatcher that way, then more power to you. But at the same time. Playing like that, I think that is part of the problem. Or rather, not really part of the problem per se, but part of the... Oh, that was a s such a kill steal. I barely even saw they were there. Thanks. That's the yeah, agony. And that's a dead guy. Setting up a barricade. Whoops. Let's pick that up. Watch the crossfire, boys. Oh yeah, they can be on the roof now. If you remain in this zone, you will be detected by hostiles. Your location has been compromised. Yeah, they blasted my nitrocell. Let's put down our jammer here and have fun with it. Op four is securing the Should container. I? Protect the biohazard container. Stop the hostiles from securing the container. Protect the biohazard container. Where the fuck did he go? If he, I mean, was that a bug or is he outside? Op four is securing the biohazard container. Intervene immediately. They ceased attempting to secure the container. Okay, that has to be a bug with the roof. Yo, really? Where else on the objective is he? If this is a bug, then it's going to be a very annoying one that needs fixing immediately. I mean, oh, there's two of them. That explains it. I, I expected there was just one on the roof, but it says one of them is on the objective, and we're on the objective right now. Fifteen seconds. Ten seconds left. I'm gonna be in armed backup here. Hold on. Nice. It was not in the roof. What the f yeah, that's a glitch. Has to be. Look at this. Yeah, I'll just have it reported at the end of this session. I mean, that that was just ridiculous. That was an obvious glitch right there. So we basically, once we are done with a couple of games, I'll probably just drop in and we'll see about it.
And so it takes a lot of time again. Barricade the room. We need to protect the biohazard container. As it stands right now with mute, I can basically rotate between these sides. But what if I didn't really have that option? What if any EMP on any of these would r make me have to run away? Also, part of the problem that, as far as people say it, is that Thatcher is basically OP because his stuff works through walls. Fair enough. But there's a lot of killing power in gadgets as well. If I was them, I would probably try to plant a zero cam on the wall or something like that. Oh, never mind. A zero cam won't work on an area affected by a mute jammer. So hopefully Sam Fisher is not going to grace us with his presence. <laughs> Stas. IQ is dead. Electricity loses. They may say if it runs on batteries, IQ will see it, but it doesn't really seem like that was how it went down. Oh, that's... I'll go back to watching the stairs and this area because so far it seems like so far it doesn't seem like I'm anyone is doing that. Op four found the biohazard container. I'm gonna be placing a C four right there just in case they get close. I know people tend to use C4 as grenades, but uh, there's a part of me that still wants to use them basically as grenades. They are in the garage. Well, there's a jammer right there. Destroy the zero camera. The Jaeger. Set up to repel. Oh, that was the team gadgets. God damn it. I need to be ready to deflect a rush. Oh yeah, text channel is uh, currently disabled. <laughs> so let's go over time with that one. Oh, we're on the attack now. That means Thatcher.
I was uh, kind of hoping that we would be on the defense now, because if we were, then I would most likely play... Then I would most likely have played Lord Chanka. Because Lord Chanka is our Lord and Savior. Also, I'm leading in kills with six of them. <sighs> Too bad we haven't been anywhere as close as good with um, attack as we were on defense. I mean, we bought our points on defense. But I also see that the classic, the classic uh, breacher and Fatra combo. I don't actually, I don't see it like at all. Also, I wonder why they changed the ping button to such a horrible spot as Z. I don't know if that's where it used to be, but either way, they it just messed up. Setting up a charge. Check the stairs. Oh wait, why am I even throwing it there when it is- Oh! Lighting is out now too, nice. That is nice. Secure the biohazard container. Go and die, please. Friendly, last operator standing. Yeah, there was no way I'm gonna I was gonna hold that. I got enough of them. And I'll have to be pleased with that. So, still top tier with Thatcher, just not really using his EMP grenades all that much. So basically, it's all come came down to the fact that I really, really like using Thatcher's... Um, AR-33. That's not really how I expected this to go, but hey, why not? <laughs> 